this is not an unboxing video this is actually how to restore this device the Huawei Y330 U01 to factory mode stock firmware that's basically what we're gonna be doing in this video and why would you need to do this well the person who owns this device kind of rooted the device and had some unwanted applications installed from unverified sources so what happens is it just pops up adverts by itself you know you can just be using the device and next thing you know adverts are on the screen also you might be looking for the stock firmware if you have issues with your phone not powering on or stock at boot screen so if you're looking for the stock firmware i'll put a link in the description what you need is a memory card and your phone you might not even need the usb cable unless you want to use the usb to make the transfer for your phone so first things first download the stock firmware link in the description and copy the dload folder into your sd card that's all you need once the dload folder is in your sd card i'll advise you also format your sd card i'm using a 4 gig sd card insert your sd card into your device and then power off your device i'll do that right away sd card inserted dload folder has been copied into the sd card now the next thing is to hold the two volume buttons up and down and then the power button so i'm holding three buttons all together keep holding until you see the installation has begun so the upgrade that is found on your sd card will be automatically installed on your phone note that this will wipe all your previous installed applications files contacts sms so make sure you do a backup before you even begin this process i forgot to mention that in the beginning but that's very important backup first before you try this so with the stock firmware installed on the sd card the phone is gonna just run through it and maybe i'll fast forward this part and you'll see in the end if you prefer the text version of a post about this process it's also on our website ngboss.com i'll put a link in the description where you can download all the files that you require to do this and also have a guide to help you while you're going along with it all right so as you can see the update has been successful it shows right there okay If you experience any issues while doing this, simply take out your SD card, format it on your PC, copy the download folder all over again into it and retry the process. I had to do mine twice, once. It is also important to make sure you have your battery level above 80% before you begin any software or stock firmware installation to avoid any interruptions while the update process is ongoing yeah it's all done this is the welcome screen um, skip no sd card inside of it accept the agreement Come on. I don't want to connect to any Wi-Fi. Next, 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 next. And finish. So every application on the phone is wiped. So the problem I was experiencing before about the applications installing by themselves has also been resolved. So if you did enjoy this video, do give this video a like and do subscribe to our channel on NG Buzz for more videos like this. See you in our next one. Bye-bye.